Hi everybody, it's Crystal. So, it's nasty and it's raining here today. It's been like that now for a few days. Um, so, I was thinking last night of a good project I wanted to make at a Red Heart Super Saver yarn. And unfortunately, I just don't have a lot of that left. So, I'm going to Walmart to check out their yarn section and I got to pick up some Super Saver. And also, I'm going to stop at Goodwill because I had a lot of people ask me if I would go to Goodwill because I haven't been here in a while. I actually have been here in a while. I go here all the time and buy a lot of clothes, but we just haven't made a video. I haven't made a video. So I thought I would. For, so for those of you that don't like to follow along, that's okay, you can turn me off. For those of you that want to come, let's go in. Mr. Bod is with me. I'm gonna turn the camera around. Okay, here we are. Goodwill. Let's see what they got up in here. They never have no yarn here though. Never have any yarn. Never have no yarn. But they never saw it again. Hey, they do have some um, good t-shirts usually though. I'm going to check out and see if they have any old Afghans. If they have some that I like, I usually try to save them. Let's see. I did notice Goodwill's prices went up though, which is kind of weird. What's that? That's like a rug. It's kind of cool looking. It's a pretty Afghan. Shell stitches, I guess. All that work for four ninety nine. Hmm. I found the coolest quilt top here the other day. I had to get it, but I don't even know how to quilt, so it's just the top and no quilt. Look at this big thing. Is this a quilt? No, that's store bought. Hmm. I'm not seeing any crochet afghans today. None for me to save. Let's go see if they got any yarn. If they do, it would be over here. What? I guess I moved it. It would be here. They don't. Let's see what's in these bags here. Old lace and zippers. Pretty cool, I guess. I don't really know what I'd use it for though. Ain't much in there either. Um, sewing patterns. Is this an old? Oh, look, it's a doll kit. <gasps> I might have to get that. I think. Look at the dress. Yeah, I got some hair. And I guess you make it Ted. That looks like something interesting that it's got shoes. Does it have both shoes? Or is it just for a doll, I wonder? And then you make the kit. There's the other shoe and the wig. That could be something interesting for me and Evelyn to do. Oh, look at our yarn section. One skein of unlabeled. It looks like Red Art Super Saver. Bunch of ribbons. Jeesh, Goodwill. There's a foam head. I don't even need that. They sell those at Walmart, too. I'm going to get this doll thing because it's cool looking. And I'm going to open it up when I get home and see what it is. And maybe you all can help me with it if I don't know. Alright. I'm going to go look at the um, purse bags. Because... Um, I like to get handles for purses here. I take the bags here and then I take the handles off of them and I use them for my bags as long as they don't have anything um, anything that's too expensive. Let me see what color is on clearance today. Oh. Green tags are 50% off. Okay, let's see what they got here. Let's see if they have any bags I could use the handles from. This one I could. But it's not on sale. I usually only buy them when they're on sale. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. It's a crown. I had to be able to take the handle off. Hmm. 
What do you guys think? I think I'm at, uh, ooh, I like this one. One big brown gold handle with the big gold clasps on it. How much is this thing? This bag here. Kind of cheap when it comes to buying stuff at Goodwill. I like it to be half off. There's the tag, let's see. $4.99. I know that's cheaper than I can buy a new handle, but. Oh, I like the chain handle on this one. Ah, it's plastic. Never mind. <laughs> that one's pretty, but I just don't see myself doing any blue bags like that. I, I more gravitate towards black and brown handles. Okay, so. Um. Not for me. This time, I guess. Well, my good will trip was not that cool, but we are getting ready to head to Walmart to the yarn section. Now, I'm telling you now, my Walmart yarn is crusty, but hopefully they have the Red Heart Super Saver that I want. So, I'm going to go over here and look at the clothes real quick, because I like to buy my t-shirts at Goodwill and my blue jeans. Oh, I dropped my dog kit. I like, um, to be honest, I like to buy used blue jeans because they're already broken in. The only thing I won't buy new is shoes. Or only thing I won't buy used is shoes and undergarments. As far as clothing goes. <laughs> but I'll buy shirts and pants. Alright, Mr. Bod's over here looking at shirts already. You got some books? I got What'd books. What you get? Stephen King? Yeah. Isaac. Pet Cemetery. He said he wanted to scare you. That's my, that's, that's, in my opinion, that's Stephen King's scariest movie. Pet Cemetery, the original. It is. God looks like church, don't he? Yes, my cat does look like church. Did you find any uh, clothes for me? Uh, I just got to like right here. All right. Well, we're going to go ahead and look at these. I know you don't want to watch us wear clothes. Hey, and then, yeah, um, likes, likes we're going to go to Walmart next. We're still at Goodwill. Oh, I found a, a knitted thing. I'll show you guys when I get home. Mr. Bob got a, got a bunch of books. We didn't find any clothes here. It was kind of a bunk trip. Goodwill's went downhill. All right, we're we're gonna pay for this, and well, Mr. Bob's waiting in line. I'm just sitting here on my butt, and then we're gonna head over to Walmart, which is maybe you can see it. It's just right across the street. Across the Out the street. door. All right. Walmart. I'm warning you. Here you go, babe. My yarn selection is horrible here. What are you doing? Huh? Are you texting? It's the... Oh. Here you go. Oh. You want to hold the camera? Sure. Okay. Oh, I put my fingers right in front of it. You do this, son. Let's go. <laughs> run, girl, run. I don't know why I'm running because I know their yarn's gonna suck. I don't have a tutorial for this hat. I bought this hat at Walmart a couple years ago. It's probably still here in the hat section, so no tutorial. Nor the jacket. Check, see what it looks like. Um, I didn't make this jacket in case anybody's asking. I guarantee you she's asking for stuff. This is hand knitted. I bought it off somebody on the internet. I can't knit, so I resort to purchasing knit items from other people, which I like to support other people anyway. So, All other, right. other fiber fanatics? Yep, other fiber. Okay, Olivia says, get me a strawberry milkshake from <laughs> McDonald's. Also, Walmart's and plate. Also, at Walmart, get plates. And Walmart. Yeah, we need plates. McDonald's and strawberry milkshake. Makes you miss Dairy Queen. Our Dairy Queen is, it's not a brazier. So it's only open during, um, what is it? Summer. Spring. Spring and summer. Summer, late spring. Wait. Let's go check their clearance out. Maybe they got some yarn on it. Mr. Okay. Bob, don't make anybody sit with you. I'm today. trying not to. It's hard not to. Huh? It's hard not to when you're running around like a, <laughs> like a kid in a candy store. 
Okay, so I stepped on something. Everyone's gonna have to have a toy. No My shoe's gonna throw a fit. Got here in the yard. I'm not a hero. See anything good? Frozen stuff. I don't see anything good. The next aisle has more. Here's some yarn. Oh, no way. One, one skein. That's how much the original price is two ninety seven. But they have it marked for two ninety seven for clearance. That's my Walmart for you. You're all right. No, I mean, didn't get it. Nothing it, good? It's still the same stuff? They try to trick you. Like, they're like, this is clearance, but I know better. It's not. Okay, let's go check the other aisle. Evelyn, uh, before we hit the, the yarn aisle. Oh, yeah. She's going to say, LOL. Look, I told you all them rice things would be gone. He has that else yeah, but just because it says was well, two ninety nine, it's now fifty dollars. Doesn't mean it's worth two ninety nine. It doesn't even mean it's worth fifty bucks. That just means they made it cheaper than fifty dollars, and they're still making something hey, off of you. Let's just get her one of these LOLs, I guess. I think she already has all these. She probably does. But I mean, I guess it's not the toy that matters. It's the. It's the surprise. It's all the trash that comes from those surprise toys. <laughs> They're about 90% trash, aren't they? Yeah. Okay, let's go to the... Um, are you coming? Let's yeah. go to the yard. I'm just filming the dinosaurs. Ooh, there's a smoker. Yeah, we'll wait for summer. I don't want the, I don't want the hmm? It's carcinogenic. I know, with my blood type. What? If you go by a blood type diet, yeah. it says that you, with my blood type, uh, it says that you shouldn't eat smoked meats or processed meats because you could get stomach cancer. Okay. Well. Did you know that? Yeah, you told me that before. Look at the camera on me. Oh, I'm sorry. Let's just go to the yarn. I thought you wanted to be it's on camera. Parking dog food. Nope. The cats. Nope. Greg. Nope. Does he need litter? I mean, you can get Greg food. I think Might as well while we're here. I think the kids put it in an empty Pringle can, but I think Clark got one of the Pringle cans and, and ate, ate the rabbit's food. Him and Mabel. Him and Mabel ate Craig's food. My dog and my cat ate my rabbit's food. Well, one cat, the street cat. <laughs> the cat right. that we found in the bushes, she's weird. She likes rabbit food. <laughs> Pellets. He's got that new treat in there, don't he? He's got that ball thing. Yep. All right, then he's good. He's got hay. All right, let's go. Greg likes Fruit Loops anyway. And he has litter, you said? Yeah, I just got body litter when we came to Walmart yesterday for the pickup, remember? We always use paper litter for the rabbit. Yeah. Because he gets uh, eye problems real easy. He can't have the wood chips. He has to have... He's pampered. And those wood chips, they say dust free, but when you dump them out, they're sure not dust free, are they? Mm. Um, Greg, our rabbit, is pampered, just like Clark and our cats. It's ridiculous. And our kids and my wife. You are more than me. <laughs> I'm just joking. Mostly our kids and our pets. All right, let's uh, see what I need to get here. Yeah. Yeah, even Walmart jams their music sometimes, don't they? Uh -huh. Don't be shocked at this Walmart aisle. Ooh. They better have the colors I want in here. Okay. You coming? Yeah, I'm coming. I had a vision, and I'm going to get the colors I need for it. You had a vision, huh? Red. Orange. Yellow. This, this went up. What was your vision, Crystal Casey? I can't tell you. You can't tell me. Where's the regular green? All I got is a big skin of. Oh, right here. Green. Indigo. That's kind of indigo, ain't it? Mm, it's like just light blue to me. Oh, Sky it's blue. Indigo color. Isn't indigo like the, the greenish bluish? No, it's like light blue. Like glowy. 
I'm probably just thinking of the watches back in the day when they had that indiglo light. Which blue looks better, this one or the dark one? Uh, for what? I'm not sure what you're going well, with those colors that you have I'll in your see hand. If you see, it's a rainbow. Oh, I see. Probably the light, light one. Is it red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet, or red, orange, yellow, green, blue? Yeah, it's indigo. Blue, indigo, violet. You so can, you can pull my phone out and ask Google if you have to. I don't. I already know what it is. So it's blue, then indigo. This isn't really that much of, of an indigo. And then I need a violet purple. Where are you, purple? Oh, let me throw these in the cart. I don't even got no purple. The big scheme. I don't want the big one. And this orange has got dirt all over it. Oh my goodness. Look at this stuff. It's 344 scheme. I might remember back in the day when it was 222. <laughs> you need to hire somebody just to come wind the skeins back up. I know. Okay, I need purple. I don't want that big purple. I don't need that much purple. <sighs> I used to be able to say you don't have a purple at home. I don't anymore. I know. I guess I'll buy the big one because I need it. Um, I got the mainstay, but I'm not going to use that. This is more the purple I need. You've really reduced your fiber footprint at our house. Haven't I though? You have. So does this look rainbow you, or is that blue is not making it look right, is it? Um, if you get the rainbow wrong, I'm going to be disappointed in you, because I know up. that you have so many rainbow things. Hey. Oh, just take my phone and do it. Just say, hey Google. What you got in your pocket? It won't recognize my voice. It will too. I can't even turn your phone on. It's different than my mine. phone's non biased. So okay, Google. Everybody. Okay, Google. It doesn't. My phone doesn't care what you say or I say. Here. You take your phone. He's such a nerd. Okay. This is how I. Google. I need some black. I, I click this little microphone. Oh. What are the colors of the rainbow? I'm just mistaken on that indigo. I don't know what... The seven colors of the rainbow are red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. Look up the color indigo. That's what I want you to look up. Is it more of a lighter blue? Is it more of a darker blue or what? Okay, I need black. Right here. Here we go. It's just regular blue. Well, I don't know. That's a little bit. It's light blue. Little it might blue. be that light blue. Yeah, this Grab one, that this one. one right here. Yeah, grab that one and let's put it together. I need this black you need a too. Light, light blue like this? Yeah. This is the one that I thought went, went better with it. Yeah. What do you Same think, guys? Way. It's hard to choose an indigo whenever Walmart selection looks like this. It's shameful. Isn't it? Phone, I guess so I'll go with those colors. Okay, do they have any purples up there? Like one? I really don't need that big jumbo skin of purple. One purple. Okay, I guess I'll buy it then. That's all they have. Okay, so this is my Walmart yarn selection. It's pretty cruddy. As is, I've heard most people's Walmart yarn selections. Do you see any more yarn that I can't live without here? Well, I'm here, you know. Take this. What do you think? Let's see. I, I do not. I don't even have to look. I've been here a thousand times. It's the same yarn. It is. I think since I don't buy yarn here very much anymore, they don't get it. Like, I was the only one that bought yarn from here. Ooh, yeah. See, they tried to fool me with that hometown. It's still the same price, two ninety seven. That was In not, the clearance aisle? <laughs> yeah, that was not a clearance price. That's pretty. Bedrock. You're a seasoned Walmart shopper. You don't fall for those tricks, do you? Heck no, not when it comes to yarn. I'm going to pass that stuff off. It's a skinny yarn. Come on, Walmart. Get. Clark really likes that yarn. kind of yarn, doesn't he? They need some new yarn here. My Walmart stinks. Oh, any good carons? Nope. Oh, I'm going to buy those, too. What else? How many times have you brought those colors down there? What, which those, those fall colors. I don't know, babe. Are right you there at the bottom. Me? 
No, haven't you Purchased made them? all kinds of things out of those? I don't know if I even have ever bought them. You have, haven't you? I bought them before, but I don't know if, uh, you know what, I'm going to be so shocked. Oh, I want to get some cotton here. I want to make some um, war shirts. So I want to get um, some cotton. Let's see. Oh, and someone was asking me to make, I swear, this yarn is used half the time. And they put it back on the shelf. It's quite, that. quite the conspiracy thing. Was that for you or just me? I wouldn't know. Break out the scale. Uh, is it 200 grams? That's the weight of it? I don't know. I ain't breaking out my scale. I don't even have one. What are you talking about? I know. Break I, was just, scale. I was just cheesing, man. Um. So, I'm going to make some more shags. And I'm pretty low on cotton. What you thinking? They're pretty low on cotton, too. Man. Are you making it for our kitchen or somebody else's just kitchen or just it, making it for a tutorial? Just or? making it to make for a tutorial. And so it'll end up in a tote? No. The kids will use the horse rags. Oh. Is that why Livy's texting saying get paper plates? That's shameful. I'm not getting paper <laughs> plates. She's, that's crazy. Look how little these things are. These are littler than last time I bought them. Wow. Well. Look at that, that's tiny. How many yards? What a rip, isn't it? And, and somebody asked in the comments, whenever I asked those questions, like how many yards or what yeah. color or anything, they asked if I, if I really care. Uh -huh. The answer to that mm -hmm. is yes. Yes, he does. I really do care. I will agree that he does actually take bits, quite a bit of interest in my yarn and yarns. And it doesn't consume me. No, but it doesn't consume me anymore either. When I'm here, I might as well learn as much as I can. What color go good? I'm on limited color sources there. They don't even have no purple or anything, no pink. Walmart, you suck. <laughs> don't they? And not just because of the yarn. I'm just making these, I guess. Walmart mainly sucks because they take all of our money. And it makes me dizzy when I stand up in here real fast. Hey. I was about to black out. I need some, um, I thought I needed some buttons for something. What was it I was going to make that took buttons? Well, you made that bunting thing. No. Oh, I, I used the buttons on that that I was going to make Alex a sweater with. Oh. That's what we bought that green yarn for the other day, remember? Al seemed kind of excited about the sweater. Yeah, I know. He is. He, he wasn't excited about wearing it in a picture, but he was excited about getting the sweater, though, wasn't he? All right. Al's a little shy guy. He is, but he's handsome. Alex is our uh, soon-to-be 11-year-old in a couple weeks. Yeah. But he's short and stocky, so you wouldn't know he was 11 by looking at him. Would you? No. Okay, let's think. I think I'm done here. So this was not a very cool trip for anybody. I kind of feel bad that you even took people on this trip. You took me on this trip. Feel bad for me. You said, let's take everybody to Walmart. And then they come here and they have nothing. Well, I personally thought Goodwill would be more exciting, but. Goodwill stinks nowadays. They all do. I like it. it. It changes. That's the best Goodwill that I've been to, though. The one in Vandalia? Yeah. Every other one I've been to was really overpriced and uh, merchandised was uh, that one's overpriced. lower quality. Don't you think? Sometimes. I mainly buy clothes and things like that, so I get a good deal. I don't usually buy it unless it's a good deal. Okay, well, let's see. I think that's it for me. I guess we'll go get some groceries, but I'm not going to bore you with that. So I'm going to turn off the camera. What kind of guess... grocery... Hey, what kind of groceries are you going to get? Uh, I'll probably get some brownies. I knew it. I was going to say we're all the way across, and across the store from where I'm already across the store. you shop. I've got to pick up some brownies. Brown... Walmart's got some really good around, little bitty round brownies. They're good. And I'll need some V8, we'll take a picture. V8 Energies. Pineapple orange. Um, mm-hmm. 
And then, um, that's pretty much all I care about. Hmm. You can pick up the rest of the food for, the, for everybody else. Oh, and I need some Ar Arnold Palmer, Palmer teas. Oh yeah, those delicious teas. Yeah. They're disgusting. Yeah. Which reminds me, I gotta go to the dentist tomorrow. I have a cavity. So, from, from the Arnold Palmer's. <laughs> <laughs> Let's uh, shut this off, and I'll show you what all I got when I get home. If what you're kind, interested. What kind of tea do I like then? Why do you keep talking? I mean, what kind shut of tea do off. I like? What kind do I like? Tezo. Tezo? I mean, what kind? Black tea, white tea, green tea? You like green tea and that one weird stuff. The what other really green stuff. What is it? Matcha. Matcha, yeah. Nasty stuff. Nice. I don't really like any tea except for Arnold Palmer's. Hey, I need to buy a new pair of scissors because... I know. What <sighs> happened to those? Get those. Damn. Boom, bling and gold scissors. All right, I need to get out of here. I already asked you to shut the camera off like 20 minutes ago. I know, but these, yeah, are, the, these are the outtakes. You didn't know I was recording. I don't put outtakes in the video. <laughs> we the should day, because we've got some pretty comical. The other day we were at Hobby Lobby and he said something about going to Steak and Shake. And I said, I don't like that nasty S-H-I-T. And I went, stop recording. And he goes, yeah. no, come on, Mrs. Bot's cussing, Mrs. Bot's cussing. <laughs> and he went and turned the camera off. But I, I edited it. This is prime footage. But I edited it all out so you guys didn't know. I, I sent it to TMZ before she got Shut to edit up. <laughs> I didn't mean to drop that S bomb in that in there. I usually don't cuss, but I don't even why are you laughing? You're the one that has I sailor know, mouth. I know. Shut a camera I off. don't have sailor mouth. That's a lie. Bold face light look at you looking right at your audience and lying right to them. Shut the camera off. You're embarrassing me. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna we're gonna go. Is it off? Yeah. I'm home! Sorry to end there when my husband wouldn't shut off the camera. I don't know what he was doing. Being silly. <laughs> Making me look silly. So, I didn't get a lot of stuff. Um, let me take this off. And because it was Walmart and Walmart doesn't have a lot of stuff. But I did get uh, some yarn I needed to make the project that I wanted to make. So, I got, you've seen it, Red Heart Super Saver. And I got it red, orange. Yellow, green, blue, and then I could not decide on the the indigo one. Maybe you guys could help me. I think it should be that one, but light blue or the turquoise blue for the indigo. I don't know. I'll decide later. You guys can help me in the comments. And then I had to get a big giant purple because they didn't have any small ones. Raising their prices on all their yarn crazy let's see oh and then i need a black so all that's for a project i'm making um and then this i got um i'm gonna make a hat and scarf out of that i hope that's enough because i have no more of it and that's all i had and then uh, someone has been asking me in the comments to take my pure innocent shawl that white shawl i made um couple summers ago and make it into a poncho and I will try to do that so I got the yarn to do that they only have three of those at Walmart I don't think that'll be enough I might have to order a couple more but that's enough to get me started and then I got a couple of things of cotton because I'm going to make a wash rag I have a cool uh, pattern that I want to use that I came up with for that I got me some new gold scissors pretty huh Every time I get scissors, people take them. And then I just got some wood buttons for a sweater I'm in the process of making my son. So that's what I got at Walmart. Oh, and then the Goodwill store. It was kind of a bust, man. They didn't have much there, did they? But anyways, I saved this. This is knitted. It's so pretty. I'm not sure. It's just like a light little, um, I guess you could wear it. Fold it like a triangle. I guess. And you could wear it as a shawl if you wanted. Or you could use it as a light, as a decorative throw to put over your chair, which I might do that. But I think it's made with really lightweight yarn. I think how much time someone took on that. And then for it to end up at Goodwill. It's wool yarn too. I can tell by feeling it. It's really pretty. Look at that. Anyways, it was only like $1.99, so I mean, it's sad that 
that kind of stuff ends up at Goodwill. But when I see something like this, I have to save it. I'll probably fold it up and keep it. Or I might put it on the back of my chair. We'll see. I think it's really pretty, though. And then I got oh this doll kit. Then. Mr. Bob got a bunch of books. I hate reading, so I'm not going to read. Him and my daughter, Olivia, love to read, so. You guys know anything about doll kits? I just thought it was something maybe we Evelyn could get. It was $2.99. It has like I don't know if it's a kit or if it's just maybe to decorate your own dolls with. I don't know. Got a little pair of shoes. Some bloomers. And a little skirt to go underneath. This pretty, pretty dress. I don't know what size of doll that would be. Maybe. Definitely. I don't know if that would be American Girl doll size or not. It's possible. It's a beautiful dress. Isn't it? I can't tell if it's homemade. There's no tags in it at all. But that don't mean anything. Yeah, there is a tag. It's not homemade, but it's still pretty. And then it come with a little bouquet. It's super cute. Give it to Evelyn for one of her dolls. I guess it's just an outfit for dolls. And another bouquet. Oh, the shoes have socks. Adorable. Little ruffle socks. And a wig for your doll. It actually looks like it was glued on a doll at one time. And then they pulled its wig off. It's kind of creepy. But comb its hair out. That's adorable. Yeah, I don't think it's a kid. I think it's just a complete outfit for a doll. So I'll give it to Evelyn for one of her dolls. And she can put the wig on and dress it up. So, yeah. That was $2.99. So, that's my uh, Walmart Goodwill haul. Not much. But, I did get some yarn where I needed all the yarn. I needed for three projects that I'm getting ready to do. Or gonna do. And then the buttons for one I'm in the middle of. So And I saved that beautiful, beautiful knitted... Uh, throw or blanket so that's it hey i hope you guys enjoyed following along sorry it wasn't too eventful there's just not much of my goodwill anymore it stinks nowadays and my walmart there's definitely not much there ever i don't know why anyways thanks for coming i always enjoy you guys uh coming with me don't forget to hit that like button maybe you don't forget to subscribe to if you haven't so you don't miss any of my tutorials that i'm getting ready to make and if you haven't checked out my other tutorials i have hundreds of them free crochet tutorials. Check them out. Thanks everybody for watching.